Hello everyone! Today we're going to be learning about 3D shapes. Now, you might have seen my collection of 3D shapes already at school. These are also called solids and they're different from flat shapes. I know you know your flat shapes really well. This is an example of a flat shape that you've studied. This is called a square and we've studied all kinds of flat shapes. We call these two-dimensional shapes or 2D shapes that are flat. Now today you're going to learn about 3D shapes. They're also called sol uh, solids because they're not flat. They're actually, you're actually able to pick them up and turn them around and look at different sides of it. So this is what we call a 3D shape. If you've ever seen a 3D movie, you know that it looks like you can reach out and touch it. And that's the same kind of idea as a 3D solid. Now, one thing that you can see is that 3D solids are made out of flat shapes like the square. Today we're going to focus on two of my 3D shapes, just this one here and this one here. And we'll get to the rest of these another time. So I'm just going to put them aside for now. Now, let's start with this one here. This is called a cube. And that probably makes sense to you because it, it looks like a cube. If you know what a Rubik's cube is, it looks something like that, where you move the parts and you try and match the colors. Now, a cube is made out of squares, which are flat shapes or two dimensional shapes. So I'm gonna show you how you can make a cube. So this is a square here, and I can actually use squares to make a cube. Cubes are made out of all squares. So, so far I've used one, two, three. I'll do one for this side, four, five, and I'm almost uncovering it. There's the bottom for six. So a cube is made out of six squares. If you see a 3D shape or solid made out of six squares, that is going to be your clue that it is a cube. So looking for those squares, all squares all the way around, six squares to make a cube. Now, this one here, this one does, is not made out of squares. This is quite different to this one. This one is made out of a flat shape that has two long sides and two short sides. And I think you might know what I mean. It is rectangles. This shape is called a rectangular prism. And it is made out of rectangles. So I can use flat two-dimensional rectangles and make this solid here. So there's one rectangle on that side and I'll put one there and I'll just work my way around. So that's two rectangles, three rectangles, four rectangles, five rectangles and six rectangles. So if you see a 3D solid made out of six rectangles, you know that that's going to be a rectangular prism. So when you're looking in your books today to decide if it's a cube or a rectangle, you won't be able to see all the sides in the picture, like I'm showing you, because I can hold these in my hand, but you're going to look for square, all squares for the cube and all rectangles for your rectangular prism. And these are the two shapes that you're going to be studying today. So be good shape detectives and find me all the cubes and all the rectangular prisms today. Have fun.